Hello guys, welcome to Passivan. In this video, I am going to review Edworking. Edworking is a remote team management tool and they are claiming that they are the alternative of Trello, Jira. But also they are claiming that they are the alternative of Slack, Zoom, Dropbox, Google Drive and more. So they are claiming that they are the alternative of Zoom also. That means you can do video calling with your team member by using this Edworking tool also you can use it as your document storage system so these are the things guys and i have been tested this tool previously and the ui ux of the tool is very good and i think the tool is good and overall they are a remote team management system now if you see the lifetime real pricing of this edworking it's only 70 usd for one code and here you are getting unlimited tasks unlimited stories unlimited video calls unlimited projects one premium user account plus unlimited basic accounts ios and android apps and one thing to clarify that this deal is not stackable so these are the things guys now without further doing let's go to the dashboard of edworking and let's explore how things work sir and how it can be helpful for you but before that one thing i want to mention guys i have created a vip lifetime deal discussion group on facebook this community is completely dedicated to discuss about various up-to-date lifetime deals available on the market so if you're interested to join such group guys you're cordially invited to join i'll give the link of this group in the description and in the comment section of this video now this is the dashboard of edworking that you will get whenever you will log in or sign up and see in the dashboard they have tasks option you can create here tasks and then you can track the progress of your task see i have been already created one task and you can do these things let's say i will create one more task here see that i have option plus icon from this plus icon just click here on this create new task and then it will redirect to here here you can see your name that means the person who will submit this task he will see his name here here give the name of the task let's say the task is uploading video and here and people can select the estimated time it will need let's say it will need one hour or you can also select day let's say it will take two days or it will take maybe three weeks so you can change these things let's say i'll select here one hour that means to do this work it will take one hour and due date let's say the due date is 31 july and here you can um, insert the description about this task let me uh, copy some text just for test purpose guys here let's say i'll copy it and then here i will paste it and see here have the formatting option you can keep it heading one heading two you can bold here let's say i'll bold it you can italic it you can underline these things here you can also get here listicle option you can add here code there have text color changing option background color changing option you can add link you can add any image if you want you can add videos and there have the option to remove all the formatting so these are the things guys that means all types of formatting option that are available after that they have option for select an image for your task so you can select any image let's say i'll search your sports and then from here you can select a image they will suggest image here and then here you can select to whom you will assign this task let's say in my dashboard i have two team member including me so let's say i'll select this second one so you can select multiple colleague or multiple team member in one work also and if you want you can also select only one team member let's say i'll select two team member here and then they have media you can add here media let's say here i will add this image you can add multiple images here let's say i have been added this image and let's say i'll add another image but you can also add videos here guys let's say i'll add this video but this video length is very big that's why it will take some time to upload maybe okay so see this is the video it has not taken a lot of time but this video is very big and then the file option you can also include your files let's say i'll add these two files here see in this way you can add files after that they have option technology you can also here mention with which technology your team members have to work on this project let's say i'll select here javascript and 
Google Cloud and let's say here they have to work with Python and then just click here create task then your task will be created see your task has been created and whenever you will create a task here a automated chat here will be added see the task name is uploading video and see here in the chat section this uploading video has been created that means now you and your team members to whom this task has been assigned they will get access of this chat and then they can chat about this task in any way if they need let's say if i send here hello then all the team member will get this hello message and then they can discuss about the work they can complete the work with discussion so these are the things and see there have option for um, basically various files so your team member and your colleagues can see the files that you have been shared in this project and then they have option for video calling so see in the AppSumo lifetime deal page they are claiming that they're the alternative of zoom so i think that's why they're claiming that they're the alternative of zoom because you can do here video calling and in zoom you can also do video calling let's say if i just here start video calling then it will call and then see it's ringing i hope you can hear now it's ringing So these are the things guys see here you can also uh, add your video as i'm using my camera to record this video that's why video is off now then here you can hear audio you can hear increase the screen size basically and also you can share your screen so in zoom the thing that you can do basically you can do all the things here also so these are the things guys i hope you get idea about this task feature whenever you will create any task then a automated message option will be created individually for this task here and your team can complete the work by discussing on this chat thread i hope you get idea guys and see in chat section you can send any type of file just by clicking here in this plus icon let's say here i'll send another file let's say i'll send this file and this file so let me see this files has been sent also and here you can also give emoji let's say i will give this emoji or this emoji okay let it be load okay emoji has not been sent let's say i'll select this emoji and then if i send it then it will be sent so guys these are the things i hope you get idea about this task feature and about this messaging feature and about their video calling feature these are the things guys and now see they have stories so if you want to add any story here you can also add a story see in my dashboard i have already added one story i cannot add any new story here guys why because i'm using my camera already to record this video but see here have the plus icon if you just click here on this plus icon then your video will be recorded and in this way you can share your live story in this dashboard and if you see how it will be shown to your team member let me close it at first let me close the call and if i scroll down from here let me show you see this is one story that i have been added if i open it see let it be load see this is one story that i have been added you can mute it you can enlarge the screen size you can basically cross it and you can stop it and in this way you can add a lot of stories here see i have been added here only one story if you want to add more story just click here on this plus icon and then open your camera your story will be recorded so these are the things guys and now see this task is in backlog section here let's say it's in progress so you just uh, have to drag and drop these things in the progress section and if it's in reviewing option then you have to just drag and drop it in the reviews uh, option i hope you get idea guys and see there have three dot you can open it you can duplicate the task you can edit it you can move it to any of this column and also you can um, basically see uh, the delete option so you can delete the task from here now let's say 
the things has been done that means the task has been completed so just drag and drop it in the complete section so these are the things guys and then here see another option has been created in all tasks if i click here in all tasks then it will show you the large dashboard basically where you will see all your tasks so these are the things guys and it's basically this task section see this is the task section it will redirect you to this task section and in this task section you will see the large dashboard of your task but in this home section you will see the summary of your you know, tasks basically i hope you get idea about this task section guys and also you get idea about this history option how you will add history and all your team members will see this story basically i hope you get idea after that they have option for files now from here if i go to the file section here basically you can uh, see all your uploaded files see this file i have been uploaded here and you can see all your uploaded files here and if you go to the live uh, section of edworking here they are claiming that they are the alternative of dropbox and google drive why i think um, on dropbox and on google drive you can store your files and on this edworking uh, tool you can also store your files that's why they are claiming and um, that that's the alternative of dropbox and google drive and they are uh, here giving you unlimited storage access guys that means you can upload here as much amount of um, storage you need basically see i have been uploaded one pdf here and here you can see the shared media see these are the shared medias here you can see and here are the uploaded medias if you want to upload more files you can upload more files from here let's say i'll upload some more files here some more files here i will upload let me upload it see these things has been uploaded so these are the things guys i hope you get idea about this feature in this way you can store your important documents important files and important medias in your project so these are the things guys after that they have workspace option so here see i have already created one workspace and let's say the name of the workspace is workspace 1 and here you can add the details about this workspace and let me copy some text from here let's say these are the text and then here i will paste it here i will paste it but see i cannot paste it basically let me undo it and then let me copy it from here let's say i'll copy this text here and then i will paste it here so these are the things guys in this way you can add your workspace and you can create multiple workspace here you can upload the cover photo of your workspace you can create new workspace also from here you can share this workspace to others see they have option for public share you can copy this url and then you can share this workspace basically to anywhere also they have option for generate blog in edworking so if i click here generate blog and then here it will redirect you to this page and here you have to select the category let's say i'll select here technology and then they have option for apply to be featured on edworking main blog okay you can enable it and then if i just click here publish then it will be published okay it will be published and in this way you can also uh, showcase your workspace as a blog i hope you get idea guys so let me find here how it will show you in this web view let me copy this uh, url from here guys and then let me open a new window from here and let me show you how it will look like see it will look like that that means whenever you will share this uh, public link then your workspace will be shown like that so these are the things guys you can change this uh, logo the edworking branding you can change basically i haven't changed yet but you can change after that now see here have option to create new workspace just click here create new workspace and then here add the title add the workspace detail and then your workspace will be created i hope you get idea guys how you can create your workspace after that they have option meeting guys and um, if you go to the edworking live team deal they are claiming that they are the alternative of slack and zoom that means you can run your meeting with your team by using this tool also and see they have option for meeting and in this meeting section basically it will video uh, call it will work as a zoom alternative and then the next option is consult 
if i go to this consult option here see i have added one consult already and if you want to add more consult then just click here add consult and see they have option to title that means here in this consult section you can ask any question to your team member also your team member can ask any question to others and then you can discuss about this question basically i'm not adding more here in this section i will explore the section that i have been added already see that i have been added these things already this consult thing already and i have been added here this um, question what is it working do you know and i have been given this title here and then i have been added the tag creative and web and mobile design there have a lot of tag here you can add and you can see how many view you have got in and how many save you have got in that means your team member can save this question basically and then if anyone reply they can reply here let's say reply one see this is the reply see this is the reply and people can vote here as useful not useful and they can also reply here let's say reply two here and then if i reply then it will be added so these are the things guys i hope you get idea about this consult option in this consult option basically you can have discussion with your teammates after that they have aid workers here in this aid worker section you can invite your team member see they have option to invite team member you can just invite the team member here have option you have to just invite them via email also they have invite link you can copy this link and then you can send the invitation link here and here some recommended aid workers are available from the aid working software and they are recommending these developers they are basically developer in various things they are experts see this person is an expert in premier pro maybe this person is an expert in salesforce this person is an expert in windows this person is an expert in python you can see how much they are charging per day and they have their rating maybe so these are the things guys here in this ad working option you can basically invite your team member i hope you get idea after that in the plus icon see here you can create new project you can create new task you can create new story you can create new consult and you can create new message also here in this section that are also available here in this plus icon see here in this plus icon same things are available that in this plus icons are available so these are the things guys i hope you get idea and now if we explore the right hand side see there have the masses here you can see all the message section here you can see all the task messages and here you can see basically all the projects that available on your dashboard these are the things guys and if you want to create your own message thread see there have option for create a message or create new message then this message thread will be created but it will be created like that see here i have been created one message thread in this way you can create more message thread here from here have the option create new message so these are the things guys i hope you get idea about this ad working tool and i think it's basically a combination of project management and remote team management tool if you think as you need this type of tool that ad working is providing us then you can get this ad working lifetime deal from appsumo i'll give the link of ad working in the description and in the comment section of this video you can get at least 10% discount on this pricing guys just go to the description of this video and get the 10% discount on ad working lifetime deal it's an affiliate link guys if you use this link to purchase this amazing deal i'll get a small commission without costing you any additional costing so if you think guys this video is helpful for you then please consider using this link to purchase this amazing deal and the last thing is visit our website www.pesivan.com to get more tips and tricks about growing online business also join our vip lifetime deal discussion group through the description of this video and if you haven't subscribed to this youtube channel yet guys then please consider subscribing this channel thank you so much guys for watching this video